How Chess.com bootstrap to $50 million plus ARR. Eric Alabest bought the domain, Chess.com, for $55,000 while at Stanford Business School in 2006. A pretty insane risk for someone just entering grad school. Eric was obsessed with chess and noticed two things happening around 2006. 1. Social networking was becoming popular with Facebook, MySpace, and other online communities. Eric felt that he could create a social community around chess. 2. Early browsers like Internet Explorer or Firefox would automatically redirect you to chess.com if you just type chess. Basically, whoever owned this domain would get hundreds of visits a day from people interested in chess. Over time, chess.com became the place to learn, play, and talk about chess. But from 2019 to 2023, chess.com went from 30 million to 100 million users. How? A combination of the COVID pandemic and Netflix's TV show Queen's Gambit, which ranked number one in over 92 countries and had over 62 million people watching in the first 28 days, brought global interest to chess. And Eric and his team at chess.com took full advantage by pioneering influencers or chess ambassadors to use promote the platform. They reached out to the biggest name in online chess at the time, Hikaru Nakamura, and convinced him to start playing and streaming exclusively on chess.com. Eric noticed a few miles away was a young girl at Stanford University named Alexandra Botez who met with her in person to begin teaching and live streaming chess to help appeal to female audiences. Eventually, the biggest names in both the chess and Twitch worlds began using chess.com as the de facto online playing platform. At its peak, Twitch users watched over 20 million hours of chess in a month, surpassing games like Fortnite, League of Legends, and Valorant. Today, chess.com has over 100 million users, receives 280 million monthly visits, and generates between 50 million to 100 million in annual revenue. The full story can be found link. Total junk posts don't explain how they went from 30 million to 100 million. Explain how they went from 0 to 30 million. That's the hard part. Man. EC just buy a domain for a thousand year old game and ride the networking wave bruv. S. Yeah grad student comes up with 55k out of his ass to buy super valuable domain name. I wonder how much of their success can really be attributed to that. Y'all need to stop calling everything bootstrapping. Your comment really bootstrapped me.